This will be a mini video for Professor Peak. This is the brake stuff that I've dug out for you. And uh, brief go through what these are. Of course, you know all about this stuff. I don't have to show you. Uh, this grabs the spring on the bottom and puts it on. It grabs anything and puts it on. And uh, put the top springs on. You put this little nib over the, the top little round button on the backing plate and you put the spring on there and you go and it forks it over and this takes the springs back off mine wrench decent Decent one, snap, uh, not a snap one though. Snap ones are the best, I guess. Look, they fit the tightest. This does the same thing. Takes the springs off on the top. And then this end hooks over there. And the spring follows this over. And this doohickey. Takes them little round caps off the, the uh, retaining springs and puts them back on for that. This is your adjuster wrench. It's got a little hole in it for some kind of reason. I never used it. And it depends on what it is. If you take the cap off of the adjusters in, on the, the big end of the adjuster, will have an R or an L on it. That'll tell you which side that they go they go on. Then you can put the cap back and hopefully you put a little grease on it. These here I just throwed in because I got like 12 pairs and uh, of course they're all rusted on the end like these. These reach in under the window cranks and door cranks on the inside door panels on the old Fords and Chevrolets and stuff. Yeah, thought you might want that, but if not, you can uh, chase the wife around with it. So, I'll get these packaged up and send them north, east. Uh, while I was digging around, my holsters are starting to get nasty and leathery, dried up. So I got to oil them things. This one, this one here, my uncle made me. But that's what I'll be doing tonight. These are some uh, 45 long Colt little piston arrows. They're not Colts. They're a copy of a Colt. Uh, Uberti or somebody makes them. But they shoot just like a Colt, and they got big, extra big handles on them, and you can't get that on a Colt. But anyway, they shoot these bad boys, which is pretty cool, especially the way I load them up. They do, they do loud, loud noises and stuff. This one here is. Very, very butimous. Well, ah, okay. This one's beautiful black. Got some really nice bluing on it. At least until it gets rusty. I really like this stuff. Well, they're not loaded. But. Pretty neat little firearms. They're fun to shoot, which is the only reason you have to shoot a gun is because they're fun. It'll make a big hole in the can. Yeah, I can twirl them, and yeah, I can draw fast, and yeah, I'm just like, uh, oh, who is my idol? Uh, uh, of course, Gene Autry, of course. Gene, Gene Autry was my idol is my idol 
and uh, let's see who was that guy they used to watch love to watch uh, I'll tell you later I guess because I can't think of it I'm having a a difficult way to, to think Cisco Kid yeah well everybody else was watching Gabby Hayes and them boys I was watching the Cisco Kid because you know he was so cool him and Pancho and his little local he rode and stuff. These are fun. Like my automatics, but these are pretty cool. Anyway, I guess that's going to be the day. <sighs> it's going to be the day, my brothers, sisters. What do you think? What? Anyway. Y'all have fun, and uh, these things here will be in a care package sent your way, Mr. Pete. All right, I love y'all. Bye-bye.